are first something about my person. I'm not military or police trained, I'm just a private person. I also didn't have any course for right shooting or something else. I just read some books and watched some YouTube videos and I want to show you what I learned from that. And if I make mistakes, I have no problems if you comment it. And I think shooting is a lot of practice. So if you don't practice, you will never shoot really good. There are some really good practices, which I know. But first I want to show you how to hold the gun. I am a right-handed shooter. So I hold the gun with my right hand and it's important that the grip fits your hand. I have here my Glock 21 generation 4 and as you see my hand has place for all fingers on this grip and what's really important is to get the grip here hope you can see it in the video take your hand and go in like this and this is the right grip I think for your shooting hand with the second hand I go like this just put the second hand the left hand on the grip with the three fingers and the thumb of the left hand is on the thumb on my right hand. Uh, when I started shooting I always had this finger on here but a friend of mine told me and he is military trained he told me that this is not good because uh, you can because you can uh, move the grip with this finger and then you don't get the target so I hold the gun like this and on this side in this position. What I also learned from a book was uh, that it is better to shoot with both eyes open. Everybody I know who starts shooting always uh, shoots just with one eye open. Uh, me too, uh, when I started I also shoot with one eye open but I trained to shoot with both eyes. After a short time of training, I think about two or three days, it was easier for me to shoot with both eyes open. We come to the sides. When you shoot at the target, the focus is always on the front side. You don't see the target clear and you don't see the rear side clear. You have to see the front side clear, so the focus is always on the front side. The most important thing when you shoot is when you pull the trigger. When you pull the trigger, you should hold the trigger with this finger and the position of the trigger should be here. Don't shoot on this position or on this position. On the pistol it looks like that and what you also don't what you should also don't do is have the finger here on the frame because when you have the finger on the frame then you can move the frame and the pistol will go to the left. When you pull the trigger, the gun is clear, I have an empty magazine in it. When you pull the trigger, don't concentrate too much on the trigger, just put the finger back and it will make click. Uh, it is hard to shoot a Glock pistol because the trigger weight is very heavy. There are sport pistols or sport revolvers 
which have a trigger weight about one kilo. The Glock out of the box has two and a half kilo trigger weight. So for me the best training was just uh, dry fire the pistol with the eye on the target and then dry fire the pistol, there will be no recoil and after you have dry fired the pistol you should be on the target with the sight and this was a very good training for me and when I went to the shooting range it really worked well. I think the best training is go on the range and combine dry firing with real firing. So you go to the range, look at the target and dry fire the pistol. And if you have done that, shoot some rounds. And what's also really good is if a person is with you and can tell you what you do wrong. It, it isn't necessary that this person is an expert. If you know these things that I've told you and you look at the shooter you will see if the pistol moves when he pulls the trigger. So once again on the target, dry fire and you should be still on the target. Focus always on the front side. The right position for shooting when you with your hands is uh, the right hand should be straight and the left hand has a winkle. What you never should do is put the second hand behind the first hand because the slide will go back and this is pretty dangerous for your thumb. The position of your feet when you shoot should be like that. The left foot is a bit in the front and you stand as broad as your shoulders are. I hope this video can help somebody to become a better shooter. Perhaps there will also be comments which help me to get a better shooter. I hope you enjoyed the video. See you next time. Bye bye.